New at six, two families forced from their homes after those houses were deemed unfit to live in. CBS North Carolina is learning both homes are owned by the same rental company, and the city says those issues aren't the first issues they've heard. It's also section, section 8 housing, meaning your tax dollars are going to that rental company. CBS North Carolina's Robert Richardson is getting answers tonight about what's being done for those families and where they go from here. Joe Best Plumber is not going to miss this bathroom or these baseboards. Wednesday marks her last day at this house after nearly five years. The city gave her until Sunday to move out. 90 days after inspectors found three pages worth of violations at the home. That could sound hard, but yeah, is that a blessing for you? Yes. That's my way out. Plummer's lease was through August. She lives with her ill elderly mother and three children. Section 8 housing assistance covers about 60% of their rent. I should have left, you know what I mean? But like I said, I was getting the benefit of the doubt to fix the house. Them being her landlord, Quality Capital. She says they failed to make repairs. They supposed to fix the floors. They didn't ever do that. They supposed to put new carpet down. They didn't ever do that. Not knowing where else to turn for help, she called the city for answers. It allow us to, to go in and do a inspection on their behalf and contact the owner. I learned Quality Capital LLC took over ownership of the homes back in November from Platinum Properties of North Carolina LLC. The office staff here in Dunn say they can't comment on the city's decisions. I've also reached out to the property's owner. I haven't heard back. I found out the Better Business Bureau received several complaints in 2015 and 16 on the previous owners. We have had quite a few complaints on, on this company as far as their housing. The city's chief building inspector, Stephen King, says code violations include problems with flooring, windows, even the back door. Plummer says she appreciates the city's efforts to help. Mr. King, he worked with me 100%. He worked with them. He tried to get them to do what they supposed to have done. Plummer says the housing authority helped her find a new place about 20 minutes away and says she's ready for the fresh start with a new company. In Dunn, Robert Richardson, CBS North Carolina.